press play. There's multiple things we're going to be testing right now. We're going to be testing the animation to see which animation it is. I can tell because I'm the one that kind of created the animation. So it should be the idle animation. We're also going to be testing to see how the outline looks like. We're also going to be testing to see how the texture looks like with the red paws. You can see the animation is playing. It looks like his face is being stretched a little bit. This animation probably came from another character within the character set that I have in Blender. So this isn't correct, I don't think. We can use this animation if we wanted to, but we don't want the 3D model to deform like this because it looks a little bit weird when it's stretched like that. You can reuse keyframe animations from other characters in Blender and then bring it over to your characters, but they're gonna be deformed a little bit different because of the way you set up the different bones in the rigging process. It's entirely up to you what you wanna do with your games if you make some. This animation looks pretty cool. But yeah, during this time, I was just having a hard time distinguishing animations and I was getting to the part where I was creating complex animations. I'm just trying my best to learn that process and build and build until I create something cool and looks very different and unique. Just getting through that animation process so that I can prepare for my complex characters as we get to them. 